As you know, we are always working to answer your questions about coronavirus. And one topic that you are asking us to address is the atypical symptoms now being associated with COVID-19. Losing your sense of smell or taste, stomach problems, even pink eye, yeah. right? We've heard about those. Channel 2 health reporter Haley Hernandez tonight with why some people are experiencing some of those odd symptoms. In so many ways, we're learning as we go with coronavirus. We know a majority of people with COVID-19 have symptoms like a dry cough, shortness of breath, and fever. I had a 103 fever. I had uh, aches and pains. I was just not feeling very well at all. But others are experiencing something totally different. People are also showing up and doctors are finding out that they have coronavirus with simple symptoms by themselves. Usually loss of sense of smell or taste, headaches, stomach problems, including diarrhea. Doctors are also seeing coronavirus patients with pink eye. And with allergy season in full swing, it's important to know the difference. When somebody truly has pink eye, uh, the story is a little bit different. It's my eye started feeling funny. Then it started, I started noticing I was getting a lot of discharge and tearing doctor. And th things started getting worse. And then my other eye started doing the same thing. So what's with these weird coronavirus symptoms? Now, the reason this happens is because everybody's body reacts differently to the virus, much like it does to the flu or any other virus that affects us. While random symptoms may show up, there is one symptom you don't want to ignore. If you start getting severe shortness of breath or you start noticing chest pain, that's when you need to go to the hospital. But otherwise, most of these can be taken care of at home if you have any questions about your symptoms, you want to talk to your doctor. And insurance companies have actually expanded telehealth services, so you could ask your doctor if they can meet with you by phone or computer. I'm health reporter Haley Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News.